Hey everybody, Matt here with LGN Gaming. So, when we last left off, I was looking at producing some chemical plants to process our light oil into petroleum gas, because that is currently our point of issue. So, in order to do that, we need some water, which, let's see, I'll do this to give them both power. Alright, so to start with, I'm going to need to build some more things, specifically pipes. So I'm going to build a bunch of pipes there. Light oil will be easy to bring over. Let's move that up one. Like I said, light oil will be easy to bring over. Water will be a little trickier, but not too much. Let's go back over here, make some more of these. Okay. Because our nearest water is right here. Oops. Okay, and then I would like to not be trapped all the time, so we'll do that. So now, we need, do I have another underground? I don't. Very good at this game. Planning ahead, having the things I need. Where's my petroleum quick gas need to go? Oh, okay. Right there. Hey. Now that should be better. Wow, do I need to throw down another chemical plant? Looks like that wouldn't hurt. Let's grab some more of these. Which, yeah, I should just need radar pipes. Okay, so now see. We have tons of sulfuric acid as well. Which, we need that for sulfur and also for mining uranium, which we have not looked into that just yet. Let's get attacked. Uh-oh, I don't have a defense there. That's strange that that's even getting attacked. Guess we gotta go handle that. Sure. 
I should have that fully covered as well. Do I have enough bullets to do that? Of course not. I can place at least one turret for now. Interesting. I don't know where that guy came from. Let's just put some bullets in both of those. Okay. And now for the thing I actually wanted to do uh, this episode is plan out a uh, power station. I watched it. I was watching some Troopin today. He seems to be like a pretty good uh, content creator for this kind of stuff. But he had some interesting things. He, An interesting thing he said, basically, was a ratio for these. It takes 25 solar panels to fill up 21 accumulators. So if I look, I basically wanted to see how many I could place. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 19, 20, 1, 2, 4, 25. Okay. It's not going to be perfect then. But do I care? See how the ratio is. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Okay, so the ratio is not perfect, but I like this because it is eight. Do I have any more long range? I don't, but I can blueprint that. So, icon can be that, yeah. We're going to name the blueprint Power Station. So, create blueprint. So, my idea is, let's see, I have a blueprint book, right? What do I not want on my inventory anymore? Rail signals, yeah. Rails. And these, honestly. Okay. The book. Right. Okay, so now just need to connect that back to my grid. So now that I have that power station blueprint, I can start building those everywhere and actually get more power. Oh, I could have literally right here built a long power pole. I am what some people call a fool. Which, I need iron sticks first. All right, so if we really need our let, uh, our network going to actually be able to do that efficiently. Here, you know what? I know somewhere that has power. Okay, 
all we need is one of these. Should honestly just be one. Yeah. Bam. Okay. So now, what I really need to focus on is getting at least my base here within my logistics network. That would be a good start. How are we doing on petroleum gas? Okay, we're actually making a surplus of petroleum gas now. That's excellent. Copper wire seems to be the issue on some of these, which I can go here. What the heck? There we go, right here. I want to build first some more of these. Then I want to upgrade them to these. I need more gears. Okay. Because I would like maybe one more set of these. should do this output priority left metal already give me what I want a bit yep looks like it sweet because the real kicker our red circuits, which if I come back down here, we have plastic now. So now, don't have an issue. So, I guess, my next thing, which if I come down here, wait, that's not building anything, that's just random. Okay, I want to build ports. I need steel, iron gear wheels, and advanced circuits.
which I need to bring our gear wheels down. Which I can do. Oh, the robots are so loud. Trying to give me more belts. <laughs> they have so much. I have so many robots that don't have anything to do. That should be sending all the remaining ones down this way now. Which means... Have that set up there. Whoops. Because this is going to be producing robo ports. Actually, it doesn't have to be that far down, even. Like there. Some robo ports. Then I need another belt coming in here. And a belt here. Okay. I need iron on one side. And gear wheels on the other. So. That's gear wheels. That's going to be iron. I need to go down just a bit more. Because of this, this, and there we go. Then we just need power. And let's see, I think I have another storage chest that should. Hopefully grab things from storage chests. Or does it need to be a provider chest? Let's make it a provider chest, just in case. If I come over here, pass a provider. Okay. Let's build some more of these on the fly. So now, in theory, that will produce a robo-port, eventually. Which, maybe I want to have a design for robo-port as well. Which, if I do, I need to look... Actually, here's a question. So the first thing I want to make is one of these, just to see what the range of a radar is in comparison to a robo port. Oops. That. And let's sit and make iron bars for a bit. Let's see. I bet a real No, radar must be a lot further than a robo port. Yeah. 
so I would only need a radar in a couple places. But I believe one of these and a RoboPort would make sense. Can I make any red circuits real quick? Just to increase how long, just to decrease the amount of time it'll take me to get a robo, other robo port. Because I'm interested in something. Let's see. Red circuits. Plastic, copper. Now my question is, do I actually have, okay, so, that's not full yet, but that's almost full. What else is using red circuits? I don't think anything would have been using red circuits. Where are red circuits being produced? Right there. Which, they are working. Item ingredient shortage. What item is short? Copper wire. Ah. I've robbed Peter and paid Paul. I'll leave those running. Goodness gracious. My green circuits are now being produced because I don't have any red circuits being produced. Which actually... Here. There we go. That will also help... Alright. That means most, the majority of our production is going to be going towards, uh, oh no, okay. Those can't keep up with the belts. Sweet. Alright. So what I want to see, then, is this production filling up. Which I'm not currently seeing. So what I might need to do is make more copper wire. When will I have enough copper wire? Good question. When that's completely full. Alright. That looks better. Oh, well, my power's dead now, so that's why. Let me make just one more, even. Just because oh, I have red circuits. Which I'm also out of science. I don't think my science has been going up. No. Which why? Purple science? Probably. Let's go to there. One more thing of copper wire. And then that 
because we want to be we want that to be full of copper wire really okay that looks like the belts can't take it away fast enough now which that is something Maybe I need to make that a fast underground belt. That's probably what I need to do. I need what? A couple of them? Holy crap. That's a lot of gears. Okay, breaking force finished. Good, good. To break the force again. See how quickly my trains go. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, let's do already. Perfect. Okay, perfect. Now we're sending stuff back. We are finally overproducing. The fact that I had copper wire be my problem is ridiculous. Am I out of blue science already? Yes. Probably need to look into that. My science production, see where that is going awry. Ah, oh, red circuits. Yeah, that makes sense. Does this say how many robots I have? Quite a few. Do I have a robot port yet? No. Is that what, 45? Yeah. So. Okay. Let's see. Where do I want another power plant? This is my main bus. I think this is... Let's see. I suppose I have some room up this way. But I really need more red circuits. Okay, that's what I can do. I have a ton of them here that I don't actually need. Wow. Wow. So, really, oh, do I don't have anything taking it out, of course not. Should have them going up instead of going down, sure. We're going to place these two robo ports and then the video is over, because I want progress to be made. Yeah, it looks like we only need one more open port. All right. To be within the logistics network, it needs to be right here. Does that actually fit? It does. Brilliant. Oh, 
then there as well. Which can come over here. And let's see. Storage chest. Do I want to blueprint that? Sure. Basic RoboPort. Create blueprint. Use shift and mouse wheel. Okay. Wait. Shift, mouse wheel. Oh no. Whew. Use shift and mouse wheel. So now I need, this is what, passive provider? Yeah. This is what, passive provider? Yes. Okay. So now I can actually start. Okay, so if I do here, I could say these belts I don't want, I want zero. Then we can say I want what? 100. Wait. 100 of those. Let's see. 25. Gun turrets. 50. Oof. Gun turrets. Fifty. All right. There now our robots are actually moving around and stuff, but I should not be doing this because the video is over. So just stand right here and let the robots just touch me a lot. Take things out of my inventory. All right. So, if you guys like this video, please feel free to leave a like. That'll help me out a ton. Um, we are going for a full Lazy Bastard playthrough, so if you want to keep watching, feel free to subscribe. That will also help me out tremendously, trying to get a thousand subscribers. We are releasing videos Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, this is actually being recorded like two months in advance. I have that many recorded ahead of time. I think the three a week is what I'm going to stick with, though. Uh, because pretty soon I have another kid on the way. So there should be a period of time where I'm not recording videos. But anyways, I think this is where I'm going to end this episode. Matt here with LGN Gaming, signing off. I'll see you guys next time.